Okay, so we got uh, the hole vloggered out, and then we got towards the end of it and realized, well, we didn't go deep enough. I, uh, I just assumed the forefoot was to the center pin of that, but it's actually to the, uh, I guess it'd be the gearbox of the auger. So uh, this morning it came out early. I went ahead and just re-augered everything out deep enough. So that's all done. So now I'm going to start by getting the, the little blocks put on the end of the columns. It's going to basically, once everything's backfilled, it create, or prevents the uplift from the building pulling out of the ground. So. That's what I'm gonna start doing now and uh, I'll update you later.
to give you a better idea of what I'm doing is it's got these 12 inch long uh, two by sixes that go on the bottom of it one on each side of the four by sixes and the purpose of that is that these will get buried in the ground they'll sit on the little concrete pucks and uh, pucks pr prevent it from going down and the two by sixes prevent uplift from wind blowing the building up out of the ground so the other thing i did which i don't know is right or wrong but i did space them up just a little bit you know they all vary a little bit but i did want that four by six being the main support sitting down on that concrete disc so that's all i've got for now i'll see you guys later